Greetings one and all to a very interesting video today. I'm going to be doing something slightly different and not only that, I have some news that I have to tell you guys which is very important for pretty much this whole month I imagine. But we'll get to that near the end. And uh, well, I hope you like the new angle. I've used some special secret tactics in order to put this on my monitor. This is the usual camera, this is not the uh, Logitech that I use. Hope you like it. So today we're going to be doing a uh, meme review. Yeah, that's totally original content, but hey, you know what? I've always wanted to do one and I really like memes. Everybody loves memes. Who doesn't like memes? So where better to start than the choose Western man meme? Now, what is the choose Western man meme? Well, choose Western man is, well, as the name suggests, pick a future, pick a thing. And usually there's a thing that usually the person likes and the person dislikes and expects the western man to pick the right choice. Sadly this is not a there is no right or wrong answer, there is a right and a wrong answer depending on the person's point of view and that's where the comedy can come from, that's where the unintended comedy can come from and that's where the politics of this person truly shines. So let's just go ahead and really delve into this meme. I've got a few examples, there's some great ones here that you're really going to like and I think it would be worth our time. Also at the end there's a nice little bit of comedy so uh, let's delve into it shall we. Choose future well western man and that is a I assume some kind of large for rent mansion in New York. Not the Southampton from uh, Britain obviously no no this is New York. Seven bedrooms, seven baths, 7,500 square feet it's very nice. Or a T-34 tank. And if anybody's seen a T-34 tank like I have, they're really tiny. Become an owner of the fabulous World War II T-34 Tiger Killer tank. Be one of the few. Well, you know, towards the end of the war, it wasn't as good as the later King Tiger tanks, stuff like that. But there were so few of those Tiger tanks that they pretty much couldn't win. But hey, whatever. So choose Western Man. Do you want a tank, which is pretty damn cool, or do you want a mansion? Oh, I guess, you know what? I was wrong, there really is no right or wrong answer with this one. God damn it, you, you're ruining the video, dating sims. Waifus, no waifus. Choose your path, western man. And as you can tell by this person's avatar, I think we all know which choice western man ought to take. Now I must make a quick detour and explain what they mean by man. Do they mean by mankind or do they mean men? They mean men, although I guess it could mean humanity as well. But I think it usually means males. I mean, waifus or no waifus. I mean, choose your path, guys. Come on. And this is from Beck, a woman. If you fap, less chance of prostate cancer, more chance of ruined sheets. If you no fap, you exude masculinity. Get all the thoughts. Obey the Bible. Choose wisely, Western man. It's either surviving or dying, but getting all the chicks. I mean, I don't know. Do you want to live forever, Western man? Choose Western man internet where you pay ten dollars a month to use a site that can be handled by a smartphone internet controlled by a bunch of politicians net neutrality guys it's very important choose your woman wisely western man fat ugly retarded loud annoying fat entitled childish Ooh. Is, is there no decent western women or women in general i mean hey this is a channel where we respect the women okay business griper i have you know so you know take that shit elsewhere Okay, all right, nothing but respect here. Respect the women, okay? And this is from the more alt-right side of things. <laughs> it's time to choose Quo Vadis, Western man. And he speaks in some weird dialect that I couldn't possibly understand. This is your nation on national socialism. <laughs> this is your nation on Zionist globalism. It's time to choose. It seems just like projection. You Nazis are so bad. Choose your path, Western man. Says Zoe, uh, Martin Feldman, String Quartet, number two, Flux Quartet, Feldman Edition, six. I guess that's a uh, modern classical music thing. Lil B, fuck him. <laughs> I don't know, that seems more like a uh, biased sample, but hey, whatever, what do I know? Choose wisely, Western man. Fuck me, I'm fat. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> the Chad. <laughs> so we've got the Virgin and the Chad. Choose wisely, guys. Who do you want to be? Either you hand children over to Nambla in its prime parades, or you're a Nazi. Choose your afterlife, Western man. <laughs> oh, choose your afterlife. Jesus Christ. I don't know where we're getting into the religious side of things. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Again, I don't know. 
It's up to you guys. You choose Calibre on Linux, I choose Kindle on Mac. Which way, Western man? PC. Which way, Western man? Migos voice. Uh, that way. I don't even know what that sounds like. <laughs> Which way, Western man? Ways aren't binary. There's a spectrum of ways, each as good as the other. But if you don't choose soy, you're a big. <laughs> yeah, nice one, soy boy. I guess we should all just eat soy and just, you know, uh, like, love the spectrum, I guess, right? And binaries, right? It's just, there's just not a thing. And I don't think this guy really gets it. I don't know if he gets this. I mean, it's literally just soy. Unless there's a thing on top of that that means anything, but I don't, I don't know. It just seems like he just wants us to pick soy. Come on, that's not a path. That's not two paths. That's one path. This is not how it works, damn it. Choose your path, Western man. Hashtag London Attacks. <laughs> From Knights of Shining Armour to Knights getting plastered on moonshine. <laughs> Can't help vacation, FOMO, hangover, fast relief. Yeah, you, they do realise that the Knights got copiously drunk so many times, right? Like, one of the big things that, that Knights did apart from fighting was partying. You're kind of getting it wrong, Adam. Because we all do the same thing. Beer's been around for thousands and thousands of years, and knights were known for their big feasts and getting merry. But hey, whatever, apparently they never did that. They were prim and proper Christians who never did anything wrong. You don't get to dictate the conversation, but no, I'm not ready to be a total cut. Now, you see, some of these are in responses to other people, so they will use the meme as a sort of argument, which isn't very, I don't know, good, because, like, memes aren't arguments. But I guess it's more to mock the person, so... That's okay. And this guy says, if you have to choose between A, being a cunt, B, being killed, your wife and daughters raped, sons enslaved, which way, Western man? Well, you see, your sons would not be enslaved, they'd be killed along with you. But that's besides the point. And now, I bring you the finale, the, oh, just so spicy end to this. It's just, it's just amazing. I, I, I wish, I wish I could just describe the spiciness. It's just... It's, it's beyond words. And this comes from my boy, Privilegy Shitlord, who is part of the Sherat Patrol. Shout out to my bros. And this is from, uh, of course, David Sherat. And this is what he has to say. Which way, Western man? MIT physicist or college dropout who looks 40? I mean, it's kind of funny, isn't it? David Sherat, who was long pining after Lauren, now dislikes her because one, he got rejected. Two, he's now gone to the other side. And three, well, you know, he... He, he's, he's just, well look at him. But then of course, his waifu, coherent states, may well be a physicist, but she's not the smartest. Well, neither is Lauren Southern. It's kind of like asking which hill to die on at this point, this one. Doesn't matter which way you turn, lads, you will be fucked. And this is what she had to say before she deleted her Twitter, which is after this and for very bad reasons. It's okay, my dude, I'm taken. And David knows it <laughs> when uh, that guy T was like, press F. <laughs> oh. Hello darkness, my old friend I've come to talk with you again But of course, I can't just end it there, can I? I mean, even Coherent States had her own little problem attempting to meme because as we know, the far left just cannot meme. So here we go, this is what she did. Uh, this is from somebody who has managed to save her tweet and she tried to do this thinking she was really smart and humorous and was totally not in any way shooting herself in the foot and it goes like this which way western man like for happily married and tolerant left wingers we tweet for insecure alt right neck beard now yeah of course a lot of the alt right is our meats but so is her side i mean she's a physicist for a reason but hey whatever uh, the sad f irony to all this is that the couple on the left are not happily married indeed this man apparently allegedly is abusive and even cheated on his wife and she had to delete the tweet because people gave a shit about it. So obviously there's some truth to all that. Oh dear, coherent states. Just more proof that the left cannot mean. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this little video. I certainly had fun doing this video. It was truly an amazing experience. I should do more meme reviews like this, in fact. There's a hole in the market now. There's a gap that I should exploit and take loads of views off it. So without further ado, I must chill and then I must go and also give you the news about the channel. So. I'm going to do the news first, so I work in a service industry, so it's Christmas and basically what's going on is I'm going to be working a hell of a lot this month, so content is going to drop in quantity, although depending on how long my shifts run, it may go up, it may go down, 
just giving you guys a word of warning. And also, as for the job, don't worry about it. Things will return to relative normalcy in January, although I might be getting more hours then because I'm hoping to get promotions and stuff. But hopefully the hours will be a lot more reasonable because now we wouldn't have so much stuff to prepare and have to deal with, like Christmas or something. There's no real big things happening in January. Also, put one of my days off of there. So, you know, more content in January and February, but in December it's going to be quite sparse. Just thought I'd tell you guys. But anyway, this has been the end of the video. Like and share. Subscribe and don't forget to press the bell or gear, whatever it is now. And don't forget to donate to a Patreon if you feel I'm worthy of your money. So, until next time, guys. I'll see you later.